Hi, this is Nira with HDPiano.com. You're about to learn How Long by Charlie Puth. Here's the intro. And that's it for now. So we had the intro, the verse, which are about the same, and the pre-chorus. Uh, question for you guys. Does anyone here play other instruments, especially guitar or bass? Comment below. If you do, it's going to come in handy for this one because the intro and the verse... No piano, but there is this bass line. In fact, that's the only thing musical happening there, um, aside from the drums. So we're going to learn this bass line. The intro is the same as the first half of the verse, so let's start with that. Uh, left hand starts out with C sharp. C sharp again, then B, B again. also known as C natural, back to C sharp, B, A, then we get this little turnaround, C sharp, A sharp, B sharp, back to G sharp. So in time slowly, one, two, three, four, one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, and a four, Meanwhile, your right hand is hanging out. I am going to do a melody version of this song in a later lesson, so uh, we're going to add in some melody in the right hand for fun. Otherwise, you can snap, you can keep time, you can just relax. It's all about the left hand. A couple notes about fingering here. I would start out with your thumb on C sharp because we're moving down. When we get to this part with the B sharp, um, you're going to run out of fingers, so what you can do, you can change your fingers here on that second B from 2 to 3. That frees up a finger. Or you can just move your second finger up, whatever is most comfortable. And now we come to the verse, and the first part of the verse, same as the intro. Here we go. 3, Four, one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, and a four, and one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three. Start out just the same again. Second time through, do we end a four, and one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, four. So the last part of that verse going into the pre chorus, I'm going to change up those. Last two notes, you got G sharp down to G natural. So from A, one, two, and three, four. Then we come to the pre chorus. So the pre chorus, we bring in the right hand for the first time. Let's go over the left hand first, though. that rhythmic bass line stuff. That's the first part of the pre. Let's look at that. F sharp, C sharp, back to F sharp. Then G natural, up to G sharp. G natural down to F sharp, C sharp, F sharp. G, G sharp. That walk 
down is C sharp, B, A, G sharp. So just that part again in time, but slow. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, and a four, and one, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, and four, and. Now, last part of the pre, we hold for whole notes. We got F sharp, G sharp, A in the left hand, and then back to G sharp. Let's add in the right hand. We start out with right hand playing A, C sharp, E, G sharp. That's while this is happening in the left hand. But notice the right hand's gonna release after a quarter note like this. One, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, and four, and one, two, and three, four, and one. Okay, so watch your rhythms there. Uh, so we've got your first chord, second chord, B, D sharp, F sharp, A natural on top, while the left hand's playing G sharp. Then we go back to the first chord, which is F sharp minor 9. Next up, got this little cluster here, B, C sharp, D sharp, F sharp. Next we have B, D natural, F natural, G sharp. So we went from this cluster to this diminished chord. Now we're holding whole notes back to the F sharp minor 9. Next up we have B, D sharp, F sharp, G sharp stays on top. Then B, C sharp, E, G sharp. Finally, we got a sus that resolves like that. So top two notes are D sharp, G sharp. You can hold on to those. Bottom note is C sharp and then moves down to B sharp or C natural while you're holding these two. So the last four chords like this. And notice the right hand keeps G sharp on top the whole time, so that's your anchor. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, four. So you re resolve on and of two. Let's try the pre-chorus, both hands, slowly together. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, and three, four, and one, two, and three, and a four, and one, two, and three, four, and one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. All right, great work getting that down. Let's play the pre-chorus full speed. Then we're gonna go back, play everything so far, full speed together. Here we go, pre-chorus. One, two, one, two, three, four. Cool. Back to the intro. Left hand only. Bass line. Here we go. One, two, one, two, three. Intro.
All right, great work on that so far. We've got the chorus up next. Also going to have a melody version of the song, so head over to htpiano.com.